got uh, Todd Weber out there, Steve Worth, and Romeo Escobar. Romeo's back in the house. Romeo. It's good Romeo. to see the boys back out. I'm sure they're looking forward to a good game. You'll recognize Romeo because he's out there in the middle with the ball right now, and it's about the same shape as his head. <laughs> Doesn't have any hair on it. The ref's always working hard, Wesco. Like to give him credit. GP win the tip. They start things off. Up high to Zach. We'll see what happens. Vader on the side. Zach underneath. Easy little layup. And GP scores first blow. Easy layup on a cut. Looks like Vader got some bright new shoelaces. Fluorescent green. <laughs> Sands with the ball. That was Wag. Wag with a travel. Didn't have an open lane to go to. Got stuck. When in doubt, jump and shoot, Ron. That'll work. <laughs> Guys are up high. Peterson again. Well, working the ball around and feeding the big. That's an easy offense. Yep, that's the plan. Try to get the inside shots, the easy basket. Wag passes up a shot. Gets back to Sands. Wag again to Kelly for a three. For good. Drops. Nice shot by Kelly. Kendall Kelly. Eagles come right back. Take that four-point lead and turn it into a one-point lead. Real quick, that's what that three-point line does for you. Down low to Peterson. You probably noticed we got Kaiser starting out there tonight. Oh, yeah, put him in, set some picks, and get some boards. Oh, Kaiser was open, too. Rosales going to the bucket, loses the handle. Good defensive play, knocks the ball off. Able to ricochet that off Honeycutt. Austin Honeycutt, a freshman playing for the Golden Eagles. Starter. Oh, really ball. Yeah. Starter. Freshman starter. One of two. John Wegg, the other freshman number 33 on the floor. That bodes well for their future. Sands with the rebound. Sands with the rebound. Vader giving him the business. Be careful or Vader will take that ball from you. Melton with the ball. There's a Gets steal. Picked. Foreman with a steal. Foreman. Foreman double team. Vader with the travel. Traveling against the Grizzlies. Ferndale ball. Uh, not uh, normal for Vader to turn that ball over that easy. Didn't know the ref was looking at him. No, nope, good pick by Porman, though. It was a good. GP, standard man to man. Gonna get in your face. A lot of movement, fast paced play. Another three Shot ball up in the air. Coming off. Rebound, Honeycutt. Leg with the ball, locked in the corner. Gets it back out of Sands. He spins right. Good ball control. Almost a steal, almost a turnover. I'm not sure who got yep. the ball. Out of nice bounds off Melton. Nice play by Rosales to check that ball back. Another turnover for Ferndale. You keeping tight track on those turnovers? I'm right trying to. They got three so far. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. <laughs> Rosales for three, three off the rim. Kelly. Sands up top. Melton to Kelly to Sands. Back to Kelly in the middle. He's going to try to drive on Porman. Not going to happen. Clock running down to five. Peterson up against the freshman Wegg. Nice Rebound Kaiser. Uh, 
Bader traveled again, didn't get called. He escaped with that one. Yeah, you saw it, didn't you? Got away with it. Bader going to go to the bucket. Gets fouled on the way. On the ground, GP on the baseline. It's foul on Aiden Sands, his first first team foul. Slice of pizza goes by. You're hungry. Rams for three. Not, Not going to drop. Rebound Kelly. Gives it to Sands to bring it back the other direction. Foreman all over Kelly. Kelly going nowhere. Right Not with Mitchell Foreman on you. Cut that baseline down. Looks like Coach got the uh, scouting report on these boys. He's got Mitchell Foreman on Kelly. Not letting him hardly even get the ball. Sands to the bucket. Nice help by Zach on that cut. Going to take that shot. Not going to drop. Rebound, Rosales. Rosales with the rebound. Peterson on the side. Kaiser up top and playing point guard. <laughs> Underneath of Kaiser. Pretty easy nice to. Open. He was left nice wide open. there. Wide open. Nobody on him. Nobody near him. Peterson almost gets a pick. Almost a pick, almost a turnover, but to no avail at this point. Three minutes to go in the first quarter, and it's still a low scoring game. It's a low scoring point. game. Glacier Peak on the verge of busting out, I think. Oh, foul oh. by Kelly trying to lose Porman. Wow. Had to end up pushing to get away from him. Had to cheer, cheer advisor Lisa Zanol over there cleaning up the court on that out of bounds play. Porman all over Kelly like white on rice. White on rice? <laughs> Provided it's white rice. Could be yellow rice, could be brown It's rice. like yellow on rice. <laughs> Bader with the lefty. <laughs> Made that look easy. I thought he could have gone up right side. He, he could have. Up. He just did that for fun, I think. But showing off, you think? Never mind. Look good. As long as it goes in. <laughs> Kelly with the ball. That was the planned move. Down to Wegg. Peterson hey. on him. Sands up top now. 14 on the shot clock. Sands going to shoot the three. And, and it is. drops. That's what Coach Brian Hunter was worried about in you know, pregame conversations, that he's got some kids out here who can shoot threes and put them right back in this game. Yeah, they can keep, keep in touch that way. Bader in the corner. Hit out of bounds by Sands. Substituting for the Eagles, number 12, Brandon Shearer and uh, Travis Hoffman. Hoffman and Shearer checking in. First substitutions for the Eagles tonight. Foreman up top. Called with the elbow. Oh. Turnover for the Eagles. Timeout, Glacier Peak. Fell on number five, Drew Bader. That's Coach wants to explain a few things to the boys. Uh -huh. Eight to six, Ron. Two point ball game. 154 left in the first quarter. Two three point shoots and just for the for uh, Golden Eagles. Won by Adrian Sands and Kendall Kelly. That's the only thing keeping them in the ball game right now. Two shots. They've taken six, I think, so far of the game, counting those two. So two for six. Live and die by the three ball, though, Ron. Yep. They haven't, been, they haven't been getting those inside shots. You notice they're trying to drive the baseline and they're getting cut off, so they're having to pass back out and they're only getting those outside shots. So if they keep hitting them, then they'll live. If they start to miss them, <laughs> then they'll die. <laughs> That's the answer. 154 in the first period left to go. And again, still a low scoring game for a quarter. Honeycutt kind of, with the ball out of bounds. Kind of indicative of the girls game last night started out slow. Yeah, it's the start of a tournament. Everybody feeling each other out a little bit. Get used to where they're going. Oh. Sands from the corner gets it blocked. 
We're not on the air. I don't know if we are or not, but there we go. Foreman on the side with it. We're back. Kaiser. Kaiser. Oh, good travel. Kaiser. Traveling. There's your anxiety for you, too. So, yep. In for the Grizzlies. Number 25, Trey Chambers. The Thief checking in. Give Kaiser Give a Give GP a different look. Kaiser going to take a breather. Sands up top. Kelly on the side now. Stroke Shearer with the ball. Still trying to work the ball inside. There's nobody open in there. That's a shear with it. Honeycutt Whoa. with a turnaround. Honeycutt. Honeycutt with a Good nice looking shot. Nice turnaround shot. He's their high scorer for the team, and he just made his first two points of the Honeycutt night. Honeycutt, a freshman. A nice 6 2 player. Peterson with a little hook, doesn't drop. Kelly rebound. Sands will bring it across. Over to Shear. Tried to force it underneath. Didn't get it. Rams comes up with a loose ball. Foreman going to push it. Decides that four on three on four doesn't work. That doesn't work. <laughs> Even four on four doesn't work for a fast break too well. Mitch going to wait for the last shot here. Got nine seconds left. Peterson. Peterson easy two. And at the corner, Richard. We're at 10-8. 